These next two examples are actually what we call compound inequalities because there are two of them written compactly as one statement. Now, this looks a little bit scary, and, and if we read it off, it says negative 2 is less than or equal to x, which is less than or equal to 3. What it literally shows you is that the x's are between negative 2 and 3. The negative 2 and 3 on the outside here serve as our endpoints, and we're talking about all of the values that lie between those. We need to show that graphically on a number line so we can see what that looks like. Let's start with our endpoint of negative 2. In order to know what kind of dot we have to put there, we have to decide is it an included point or not. And because of the equality, it is an included point, so we would put a closed circle there at negative 2. Now on the other end, at 3, there's also equality there because this is also a, or equal to. So on 3, we would also put a closed dot. And we're talking about all of the x's that lie in the middle of those two values. So in order to graph it, I would need to shade in everything between negative 2 and 3. For the next problem, we've got 0 is less than or equal to x, which is less than 2. So here again, our values lie between 0 and 2. So we need to show that graphically. Now our endpoint of 0, we need to decide is it a closed circle or an open circle. In this case, it would be a closed circle because there is equality associated with that endpoint. The other endpoint is a 2. Here we need to decide is this a closed circle or an open circle. There is not an equality symbol here so we would have to use an open circle. It is quite all right. I mean, you really need to look at both of these endpoints independently because they could either both be open, both be closed, or one of each. So you can't take it for granted that one side is included, so the other side must also be because that's just not true. Now we're talking about all of the x's that lie in the middle of these two values, so we would need to shade in everything between there.